long touchdown drive we just saw. You wonder if maybe that's taken a little of the wind out of this offensive sales because they had it going pretty good last time, too. Philip Dorsett by himself. The 20. In your face. Touchdown, Jaguars. Philip Dorsett, 75 yards. And the Jaguars are able to strike quickly for six. And we didn't even get it. So the football will be at the 25-yard line as this offense gets set to take over. Throwing on first down. Madden flush to his right. He'll have a first down past the 40. And this turns into a nice gain with a slide at the end. Now the Jags will use the second of their timeouts as he'll stop it with exactly a minute to go before halftime. On first down, Madden out to his left. But he's got Dorsett complete. He's going to go out of bounds, but he takes this one down just shy of the 20. A big connection on that one. 32 yards. So the big play gets him all the way down to the outskirts of the red zone here for first and 10. Operating from the gun. Madden. And that is caught. Touchdown, Jacksonville. Philip Dorsett. Already his second touchdown here in this opening weekend. And the Jaguars are looking good here in the season opener as they're able to extend their lead. So a good start to the campaign so far for them here in week one. Yeah, all the things that you dreamed about. So the offense set to take the field here. They will have the football with less than a minute to go in the first half. A final shot before break. Madden, nowhere to go here. He lost the football. So we've reached halftime here on opening weekend. As we send you on over to Orlando for Jonathan Coachman in our EA Sports Halftime Report. Take it away, Coach. All right, Brandon, thanks very much. And welcome back to football, everybody. We've got a full slate of 16 games here to start the new season. So let's take our first trip around the NFL. We'll start out in Indy, Seattle in town for the season opener against Indianapolis. And it's the Seahawks who have the lead as those two teams approach halftime. Chris Carson has a touchdown run. From there, let's head over to Highmark Stadium to check out what's happening with the Bills. And you can see they trail in that matchup against the Pittsburgh Steelers. Deontay Johnson, a touchdown reception. Finally, let's get to the country music capital of the world and see what's happening with the Titans at home in Nashville. And that game level as they take on the visiting Arizona Cardinals. Meanwhile, in our game, it's been a back and forth first half. Who can put it together in the second half? For the answer, we turn it back over to our broadcast team of Brandon Godden. fatigue becomes any kind of a factor as we are back underway in the second half. No run back here to begin the half, and we will start at the 25. Jaguars come to the line to start their next drive. They've got to right the ship. They had a great first half, but the lead has really gone down. Now, you know, you always talk about the adjustment to the adjustment. They've got to adjust right here. And I think a lot of it is just mentally get back to doing what you were doing well in the beginning of the game but a lot of that is playing with that emotion and that sense of pride and fire that sometimes goes away a little bit when you build up a lead you think you've got it going and you also think at any moment i can go ahead and go back to the way it was before you and i both know it's not that easy once you get off the gas a little and they don't want to see this lead diminish anymore and he's going to get this one down to the edge of the red zone a big play that time through the air. 32 yards. So a big play as it gets him all the way down to the 20 now for first and 10. Now a give right side. Robinson. There's Robinson showing the flash. And that's just a solid, good physical run there as he motors for nine yards. 
He hasn't had a ton of success here so far, but you get the feeling that he might be on the verge of popping one. Yeah, even on that one, there was a little bit of a hole, but it closed there quickly at the end. And this play goes nowhere. Losing yardage back to the 15. So that'll go as a four-yard loss on the play. And they're going to have a third down. Looking to throw. Madden escaping the pressure right. Got his man. It's caught. Touchdown, Jaguars. Travis Etienne. His first NFL reception goes for six. And the Jaguars are able to widen their lead. Well, I think, and correct me if I'm wrong, but his top two options were not available on that throw, so he went this. Jaguars come to the line to start their next drive. Their lead down to two scores after the touchdown a moment ago as they start with a first and ten. They start on the ground with Robinson here. And not much to speak of. Call it a one-yard gain up to the 26. In the first half, he was held in check on the ground, but despite that lack of production, they still have the lead. Yeah, and they've got to feel fortunate about that. If they could actually get production from their lead horse, that would help open up this offense and widen this margin, too. Eluding the pressure right. Oh, the ball comes out on the hit, but they'll say it's incomplete. After an incomplete pass on second down, that'll leave them trying to convert on third and nine. Rolling to his left. And now he'll let this one go deep, back over the middle. And that's caught inside the 35. And he makes it all the way down to the 31. A big third down play there for the Jags. So the big play changes the complexion of things. Here's first and 10 just outside the 30. And as they come to the line, they will not be able to get off another play as time has run out on this third quarter. This is the National Football League on EA Sports. He finds Dorsett. It's complete. And he takes it in. Touchdown, Jacksonville. Philip Dorsett with now three week one touchdowns. And the Jaguars are closing in on a winning start to the year as they extend their fourth quarter lead. So this offense will head back out there already in excellent field position thanks to the interception. On first down, it's Robinson. And they're going to stop him right at the line of scrimmage. Just no cutback lane to be found whatsoever. Second and 10. So after the run for no gain, here's second and 10. Off play action. Madden on the move to his left. Now he'll let it go on the run. Deep left side. Got a man. It's caught inside the 10. It's a big play for the Jaguars. Even with the big lead here in the fourth, it still bombs away. And frankly, it's working. Why should they stop? Go ahead and keep firing away and gaining those yards. Back to throw. Madden. That's out wide here for Robinson. Touchdown. James Robinson, already his second touchdown here in this opening weekend. And the forced turnover on defense leads to six points. Jaguars come to the line to start their next drive. Been a very strong performance for them, really, on both sides of the football. The turnover on downs, the most recent example. And now, obviously, they're in a great spot here. Yeah, if you're over on the bench right now, you're shaking hands with your teammate, you're hugging him, give him a little dap. Been a big, big performance for them. Now you just don't get careless. Take care of the ball on the way out. On second down now. It's Robinson. Now Robinson coughs up the football. It's loose. And the Texans say they have it. They do. Both offenses have been clicking in this one. A lot of points on the board. We'll see if that trend continues. A quick throw complete to Chark. Seven yards, the pick up there. 
A nice throw there. We've seen a lot of those from this young man. How would you assess, Charles, his first start thus far? I think it's been everything that they could have asked for because he's handled all the basic things quite well. And even some of the wrinkles that have been thrown at him, he's shown a lot of poise throughout. Touchdown, Jaguars! DJ Shark, 38 yards. And the Jags are able to strike quick. So now we're in the final minute of the game in the fourth quarter as this offense gets ready to take over. Now a handoff to start it out. Robinson. Robinson, a first down and then some. And he'll be out of bounds, but able to get it up past the 45. 41 yards rushing now on eight carries for him so far. This defense, Charles, they have unraveled here in the fourth. In a sense, it's like they're being pressed, like in a basketball game, and they just can't get the ball over half court. I mean, no matter what they do, they can't get off the field, they can't slow them down, they're just going up and down the field against them. Yeah, unraveling would be a perfect word for them. A nice completion there for the first down. And, Charles, you think about the quarterbacks of recent vintage that have been thrust into action week one. It's no guarantee of future success, but we sure have seen some good ones. We certainly have, partner. How about Joe Burrow with the Bengals in 2020? He was excellent. Kyler Murray with the Cardinals. The best part about his game has his team run the brink of the playoffs. And Deshaun Watson has won division. And that is caught. Touchdown, Jacksonville. A great play there. 33 yards, and the Jaguars add on to their lead. What a difference a year makes so far, at least. These guys last place in their division a year ago. Looking like they're going to move to 1-0 right now. Not really unusual in the NFL, though, is it? Because we always talk about every year, eight. A big offensive explosion helped lead